Trump. I don't know. What do you mean what you don't know? I, I don't know what's wrong. Uh, Dan? Come here. What's wrong? I don't know what's wrong. Back up north. What are you doing? Yo. Yo, what up? Yeah, I'll keep up, bro. And we got a new face on the channel. Hey. I'm sure most of my subscribers know exactly who you are. I'm getting dressed right now, but hi, everybody. Here no, you take doing? it off, take it off, bro. All right, I'll take it off. How about that? Right, so we are up north at the moment uh, in Chester. A rare privilege for me because I live down south now. And we're going to go do an infamous house that you guys made viral. In fact, it was because of the video that I filmed uh, last year that this place is even called the Screaming House now. It is obviously the Screaming House, the murder house, where unfortunately that teen was killed and her body dumped in uh, the backyard. But I figured since we're in the area and these two have never actually done the Screaming House. I want to hear some screaming. Is there actually screaming? Well, I called it a screaming house because I have an Aztec death whistle Ooh, and I, I used it and activity kicked off that night, right? It always kicks off when you blow in those Oh, you know about the death I whistle. Haven't. You've been using it? Yeah, I've used it a couple times. Oh, I see. Okay, good. I'm glad the Aztec death whistle is picking up on, uh, well, for paranormal investigators because it is a really good tool. But yeah, neither of these two have done it. This place, like I said, back in the late 70s, a crazed man stalked a teenage girl into her house when she was going home, murdered her in the living room, oh. took her body, and dumped in the well behind the house. 100% true story. There's news articles on it and everything. So the well right? is still there? The well is not still there, yeah, unfortunately. Like they were going to get rid of it, yeah. obviously. But this is a true story, and this house is horrifying. Inside, last I went, there were like tools of murder inside. It was, it was insane. It was a creepy place. We also found, oddly enough, a digital recorder in there that already had EVPs on it. I don't know if another ghost hunter had accidentally left it there or something. You might have gotten like, scared off or something. Yeah, I, I don't know. But there was a lot of really weird stuff with this house. So, it's literally 11 minutes away. 11 minute drive. It'd be rude not to. It'd be rude not Obviously. to. We gotta go check out the screaming house. It would be unghostly unless not go. Very unghostly. Very <laughs> unprofessional. How are you gonna be ghost hunters and not go to a murder house? Can would I, you look uh, at that? My shoes are already on. Get those shoes. Let's right. go. I, uh, test some Pokemon Go that I'm replaying now. Bro, what if there's a gym at the screaming house? We'll try. Haunter. Gengar. No, that's a bad taste Bro, joke. Eight. That's a bad taste joke. I'm sorry. Pokemon Go. No ghost Pokemon. Let's say if we can catch a ghastly there, I'll be happy. Catch a ghastly there. Right, everyone. We're gonna set off now, and uh, honestly, I am a bit buzzing. I don't normally vlog like this, but to be fair, I got two of these awesome YouTubers with us. How can I Thank not you. be buzzing for this? Anyway, you know, Exploring with Fighters, right there. Most Argy, right there. If you're not already subscribed, Proven Demon, subscribe. We'll see you at the Screaming House. Right, so just as a refreshing reminder for myself and you guys, this did happen in 1977, and it, yeah, Brenda, her, her name was Brenda, at 17 years old, was strangled in her house and then dumped behind it, and it's a cold case. So they never found the killer, sadly. Um, I, I, that's, that's just a heartbreaking story. It's 1977, and the family never even got answers. But I am looking forward to seeing where tonight's investigation takes us. It's never a disappointing night at this place. Oh God, here we go. I'm actually praying to God it's still open. We're in boys, we're in. It used to be, the well used to be back there, but it's not there anymore, man. Yeah. Alright, time to go in. Hello, old friend. It's been a minute. Hey, everything's still here. Yeah. Wow. It's been a little bit trash since the last time I was here, but it's not bad. It's not bad. I can already feel a very bad vibe in here. Yeah, me too. It's not the biggest house, but we're not here for the size. We're here for the action. In we're here to communicate with this girl to see who the murderer was. 
And the fact is, no matter how big the house, it doesn't mean they have a story like this one. Yeah, exactly. And look at, the, look at this. This is how you know you're in the UK. I've never seen anything like that. Uh, coat of arms. Look at, yeah. Let's see what's in here. Wow, it's it's different. I'm not gonna deny it's it's different. Piano's still here. Dude, look at this. Everything is literally still here. Yep. It's right out the seventies too, isn't it? Mustard green couches. She was killed in the seventies. Yeah. In this room. In this room. In this room. Strangled? Strangled to death and took out the back door into the well. Into the well. And the killer was never found. So what are you thinking, man? Should we uh so maybe set up some of the equipment, the music box and all that? Yeah, yeah, so for, for this kind of thing I reckon uh music box, which okay. is uh, obviously the yeah, Power Forge music box. I remember that. That's terrifying when it goes off. Yeah, yeah, really good one. Um, REM pod, REM pod classic. Yeah. We will use one of these because, just because I know that you guys are going to have the privilege of having this on Proving Demons. I uh, bought one and it'll be here in a couple days. Yeah, so that's good. So we, we'll use that the Alice box, uh, which is like um, an obvious. Uh, what else should we use? Uh, we'll probably pull a K2 yeah. out and the S box. Just the basic box. equipment. Yeah, 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 general stuff. Nothing, nothing too serious, you know, until it starts kicking until off. Until it kicks off. Maybe I'll get the second box out. You know, not. Oh. Right, so everyone's already talking about how uncomfortable they're feeling at the moment, and I don't blame them. To be fair, I've never been comfortable stepping in here, even though it has changed a bit, including that. I wasn't here the first time I came here. For the most part, it's all intact. Everything. <sighs> right. Do you know what, though? Like, I don't often get like weird feelings anymore. Like Since me and Andrew used to do a lot of paranormal, I used to be really scared of it, and I got rid of that fear, and now I like embrace and enjoy it but I have like a bit more sensitivity about it. So when I came in here, I started feeling like really anxious and I, I didn't want to be in that room on my own. I was kind of like looking behind me, you know, like when you go upstairs. Um, so yeah, I'm feeling a lot more uh, yeah, anxious about this one. Uh, and now knowing the history, it's like, damn, damn this, is, this is like, this is the focal point in this room. This is where it all went down. This is where, people's lives were changed forever and that kind of stuff gets embedded in the walls and the residual energy never disperses you know it's always here so it's going to be very interesting to see what happens and i've just had a double espresso and a red bull so my caffeine uh, adrenaline is off the charts yeah, at the but moment so. saying that man i'm not i'm not even being funny right like i feel like you know that feeling in your chest when like it's almost like when your fight or flight's about to kick in yeah i've always noticed being in here it's like it's just a constant steady like Almost your fight or flight wants to just make you run out or like it's probably you know. you're probably picking up You probably you don't realize it, but after doing this for so long like we, we start to, to adapt abilities right? Oh, yeah, absolutely and you might not like completely understand your ability But a part of that ability is able to read and sense what's happened to you in the past So just because you're feeling like that it's because you know the traumatic experience happened here where someone's life was taken Someone's life was literally ripped out of the, out of the body and their soul is has been embedded in the fabric of this room so knowing that you're 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 kind of like you know do i fight this or do i just get out because you know that that's happened to you you know yeah. uh, if that makes sense see i have let a, me know down below because I, to me it makes sense but it's always a problem like, damn what are you talking no, about no no it makes sense it's funny I, I had a different theory also to this that it's potential that the energy stored here during the actual murder is the energy that she was feeling moments or during it happening. Yeah, of course. Yeah. No, of know? course, no, because it, no, it makes complete sense because that adds to the anxiety. Sometimes you feel depression in these places and it's all because of the emotions that that person was going through at the time they lost their life. Absolutely. What's the matter? So why don't you close the door behind me? No. No? Okay, the it, door is open. I'm gonna show you on my camera right now. That door just closed. I actually cut it. Like, just then, just like shut. There. Yeah, no, 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 it was wide open, like, the whole time. I'm talking on camera and it was behind me. Okay. And I just closed, I'm gonna show you on my camera. You guys can record this. Yeah, 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 absolutely. No, we were just doing an intro. So I'm talking, right? Yeah. Oh, shit. Door's wide open, right? Okay, look, 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 look. It's right behind me, the door. In case, like, there's something in the background, in case we hear some EVPs on the actual mic on my audio. Look at that! No oh, shit. Guys, I, guys, yeah, I'm not yeah, touching yeah. that fucking door. So it just closed behind yes, you while you're chilling. 
I thought I thought maybe one of you guys like reached in and, no. and grabbed it. No, we, bro. We've been no, I'm here. shaking. You, you would have hurt us, man. I was literally just doing a piece of his video. Oh my god. Yeah. Good start, good start. <laughs> I mean, I'm look right. at that face. You can tell that's a serious face. Bro, I'm in her bedroom talking about her and how it smells like her. And if you guys hear anything, like... Actually... Where's my K2 meter gone? That's on me. I'll do a quick sweep of the house for EM. Oh, there's a small little spike. Hey, Brenda, you want to make an appearance tonight? Okay. Ew, is this blood? You just got a spike here. I don't know, it's brown. Brown Blood usually dries brown. Yeah, it dries up. It's like blood splattered, dude. Brenda, while Mo's asking questions for you, could you please? Oh, there you go, spiking. Just there. Oh, we are there you go. There you go. Oh my God. We're getting a solid EMF reading here in a house with zero power. So what? Explain that, skeptics. And that's right by her bedroom, dude. Yeah, you're right. Oh, Just seeing. Yeah, and then this one. Brenda, if you're in here, can there you go. Oh, look at that. You see that going off? So there's some energy in here. Some proper energy going on in here. Oh, dude, 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 come here, come here, quick. It's maxing out to red. It's go maxing out to red. red. In her bedroom? In her bedroom. It's just maxing out oh by her bed. Oh, my God. Okay, so this is where the highest level of EMF is. So I can understand that door shutting on you just yeah. a second ago. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. That is not normal. That is absolutely not oh. normal. And it's not even stopping. It's just maxing out. I got to get my EMF meter up. Wow. Yeah, go, go get it. That's weird. It stopped as soon as Mo left. It's almost like. Do you prefer Mo's company? That's so, interesting. Thinks Brenda likes me. Yeah, well, for some reason. Yeah, it stopped as soon as you walked out. Yeah, and look, it's, it's now crazy. it's going crazy. You can see it on camera. It's going absolutely bonkers. It like, she likes you. Well, hopefully in a good way, not in a bad way. Hopefully not in like a, a demonic like sexual way too, you know? That'd be weird. I hope it's not. I, I don't tend to think that this is a demonic sexual... Oh, no, it's still going. Alright guys, so a level of EMF like this is actually quite surprising. Oh, it's happening in here. But it's actually quite surprising, this. I mean, it's not because this place is haunted, but it's surprising in the sense that... It's happening. On request. What's wrong? I don't know. What do you mean what you don't know? I, I don't know what's wrong. Uh, Dan? Come here. What's wrong? I, I don't know what's wrong. I've never seen this. What the fuck? Mo, are you, do you want to try and talk about it? I, like I'm standing here and it felt like something just like fucking grabbed me. And it just gave me a shit ton of sadness. Bro, he's being, he's being possessed. He's, well, no, you're being affected. Yeah. You're not possessed. No. You're not possessed, you're affected. No, you gotta be strong. There's, I swear to God, there's somebody behind you. Dude. Yeah. No, 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 there's literally somebody walking behind you. I just saw somebody walk by the window. Something grabbed me. Just, bro, actually, you know what? I just saw a shadow behind you in, in that room. I, I don't know if someone's walking on the outside of the house, around the windows. I hope not. I saw somebody walking outside. Something just clicked in this room too. Something grabbed me. Something are you gonna be a, you're gonna be alright. Something bear hugged me. Yeah, I promise you're gonna be okay. Yeah, just so take a breath and just I've never shed tears on any paranormal investigation in my life. Yeah, I know, that's why you just literally shook me up there. Yeah, the, the trying to it's, it's, it's almost a tr the, the trying to possess, right? But if you're strong minded, you don't, you just get affected. Okay. Just stay strong minded. Just stay strong, stay strong no matter what. See it in your eyes. Yeah, you were welling up big time, bro. Like we genuinely had, we thought something was like deathly wrong with you. I, I'm I'm scared and like kind of like tearing up because I thought I was about to become possessed or something. Yeah. Okay. I, that's what, as soon as I came through, I, I saw you and I saw the tears. I could see like a different emotion in your face. It like you were ready for being possessed. Okay. 
Let's just stay. Let's yeah, let's stay not. Just let's calm. let's not let that happen. Stay strong. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Please, no, I don't want We're a team. We got this. We'll pull through. Yeah. The ghost hunt's are not even started. We got this. dark because we don't know if that was a shadow he saw or if that was somebody outside looking at the house and now we're getting a bit paranoid. It's possible it was, it was, a, it was a shadow. It's possible. Yeah, I'm going to be honest. I'm actually really uncomfortable out there by myself. That makes me feel well uncomfortable. Dude, I've never, I've never experienced that before. Like, I've been, yeah. I've been through it, but I've never felt like I wanted to cry. Like, I pretty much did cry. It sucks. All right, come on, guys. We got this. We, we we totally got this. Just keep it cool. I mean, I was calling out to Brenda. Yeah. Right. Just looking around outside. And yeah. Through, through the see but um, we keep seeing like shadows, which makes sure there's no one on the outside. But Mo's already been quite quite badly affected. Mm -hmm. You know me. I'm not speechless at all. I'm always talking. Yeah. Right. Well, I'm going to be honest. I'm shitting the brick at the moment, personally. You, you like, know, as a, as. A, I felt like something was touching me yeah. or overcoming me. My K2 was spiking straight to red. Like it was going crazy in my hand. Yeah, the K2 has been acting up yeah, immensely. Okay. Well, it seems most of the activity is happening out in the bedroom, so maybe we should start off in the bedroom. Without a doubt. Yeah. Tell you what, I'll grab a spirit box to start. that it will go off and that is the scariest creepiest thing to go off in the dark that i hate that music box but i love it so much right we'll also put a couple of cat balls we'll put one on here oh yeah one there and we'll put one here because we kind of think that she might be struggled on the sofa probably so we'll, we'll put this one here okay Brenda, we mean you absolutely no harm, and we come here with the utmost of respect. We only wish to learn more about your story and anything you can tell us. We understand that you came to a horrible death, and it is absolutely unfair and unjustified that they got away with it, too. If you know this person in any way, shape, or form, can you use any device tonight to let us know who they are? Or if not, even just the blessing of communicating with you would, would be a privilege on our behalf. Do you guys want me to run a spirit box to start just to see? Or? Go for it. Right. Brenda, if this is truly you, can you say your name for us? Interesting. Interesting question. Brenda, are you here? I'm here to stay. That's technically an answer. Are you here? And it came out, I am here to stay. So it did directly answer. It's really weird from feeling here. No, I'm not lying with you. This is a bit overwhelming now. Yeah. Brenda, where are you right now in this room? That's the cat ball. Oh shit, I'm so sorry, guys. I have my fingers slipped. Brenda, touch one of our cat balls. Brenda, can you say your name for us clearly and with purpose? I don't know. That sounded messed up, no. It just said, it just said, I'm cold. I'm cold. It just said, I'm cold again. Brenda, what can we do for you? What can we do for you?
I'm going to be honest. All the AMF was happening in the bedroom. I think this would be better carried out in the bedroom first. I think mean, we're, we're doing a, a good like build up here. You think so? Yeah. 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 Building an NGO. Well. Sure. I can feel it. Hey Brenda, if you're actually with us, can you shut that suitcase? Close it right now. Oh, oh. The cat ball's going off. Oh. Cat ball's going off. Okay. On its own, going off. Are you actually with us? She's here. Bro, She's here. She's made herself known. Do you have energy to close that suitcase? If you do, please close it right now. Or at least touch the cat ball that's beside it. That cat ball hasn't gone off all night. No. Please, if you could, let us know that you're here. Just go over to the other cat ball and touch that. Then we, we can definitely know that you are here and can understand mm -hmm. us. That's me. That's just me. We were putting yeah. that one down. Was it you that kind of like hugged me or touched me? Okay, well, it's off now. Just when I said that, I just felt like it was it was kind of like here again. Mm -hmm. I'm getting that same feeling. I'm just gonna come back over here and like to the corner. Brenda, I know it may be hard to use what little energy you have to communicate, but if tonight's the night. And I know a lot of people have been trying to communicate with you recently. Use all your force with us. Really, truly, and powerfully show us you are here, please. That's a weird anomaly. That going off once and... Yeah. That was it. There is music in the hallway. All you can do is step in front of that. If that music box goes home and home. Oh fuck. What's wrong? Migraine. Oh shit. <sighs> Brenda, are you causing these fucking migraines? Ow. <sighs> I'm telling you, Brenda likes smell. They're going away. Either it's Brenda or it's something it's like, dark here. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, right here, right here in the, the middle of my, my, what do they call it, temple or whatever? Yeah. Head. Brenda, can you make something move? Don't hurt me. It's like she wants to physically attack me. Mm-hmm. Alice box. Let's, Let's do the Alice box. I love this. Is that going to give us actual voices? Yeah. Yeah. And it's going to, it, it's quite accurate at times, this thing. Okay, there's a box on the table. You can basically talk into that and it will manipulate your voice and allow us to hear it properly. So if you can give us a name, please give us a name of the man who killed you. If you can do that, that'd be brilliant. She's ready. There's a small behind us. <gasps> deliberate. 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 Kill to deliberate. Could be deliberate, kill or deliberate, yeah, or kill to deliberate. Guys, did you notice how just before that happened, how quiet it was? Yeah, yeah. Covered in goosebumps no as well. Road noises? Yeah. There's it's... broken windows in this house. There's no road noises, nothing. Nothing at all. Did he kill you deliberately? Oh. Soak. 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 She was dropped in the well. Soak. Oh, she was. She was dropped in the well. Yeah. She, she was, was dropped in the well. What the hell? Guys, I've got goosebumps. Take. 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 Soak. Deliberate. It just sounds like she's. Re her life. It's like yeah. she's reliving the murder. Her life. her life was taken. He took everything from her. Brenda, close that door that's in front of me right now. You have power, clearly. You've been affecting me all night. Can you close that door? What do you have in your hand? I was going to say, have you ever seen this? Is that a death whistle? That's my death whistle. Holy crap. Bro, we should just go for it. Let me get a close one. on that? Yeah, of course. Oh, my God. So the death whistle in the Screaming House might not be a, bad, not be a good idea, but it's also not a bad idea. This is the sole reason it's called the Screaming House. Because this worked so well when I did this last time. Really? 
I'm just going to do one very loud one, and then we'll just see where it takes from there. Right, okay. Brenda, I'm only doing this to awaken any energy that might be stored in the walls. I apologize. Oh, and if anyone's watching on anybody's channel and you hate the death whistle sound or you're afraid it will affect anything in your house, I cannot prove or disprove it will not affect something on your end of the screen. So now's your chance. Turn the volume down. Three, two, one. What? Minute. minute. You have one minute. No, you have three seconds. I'm sorry. Holy shit. Oh, so sorry. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Let's see what that machine has to say now. Oh, it's, it's getting something. Little. Little. What the? Little, little. Little. Why? I don't know. What's wrong? You okay? Yeah, just some shot across my face. You don't see that? No. Yeah, you just saw like some, so yeah, you saw yeah. something. You both were pointing your cameras at me. It's a like some shot across my face. If I caught it on camera, I will make sure everyone. I don't know what it was. I'll, I'll note it. Hey Brenda, did you just shoot across Dan's face? This place always makes me feel stupidly tense. I'm not it's the fun. It's a tiny house, but it's so terrifying. Yeah. You know? Uh, Alright, just for a moment. See if this made a difference. Brenda? Are you there? Little than children. It's two words. Children. She meant to say little children. Did you, did you want children? Instead. instead. Little, little, children little children instead. Instead of death. She wanted children instead of death. So was this a parent's house or what? This was a parent's house. Why was she a law? I, don't, I need to know more. Practice. What do you want us to practice? Practice. Okay. Well, that, that moth is like coming straight towards you. Well, so, how, why was she here on her own? Do we know that? It might have been after school for all I know, mate. C can, you, can you tell us why you were here alone? Was it school? Was, it, was he a family friend? Can you give us more of an indication? We need his name. If you can give us his name, we can help you out. We can bring justice. I can try anyway. Applet. I don't even know what that word means. What? Applet. 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 Applet Mandy. There's a name. Mandy. You know, if the killer was never caught, how do we know it was a boy? Yeah, that's yeah, true. Exactly. Applet Mandy. Maybe the last name was Applet Mandy. Mandy Applet. Applet. Let's, Dude, let's... We, I just asked for a name and it gave us a name instantly. Let's... Well, whatever you guys saw outside it definitely was not a person because they didn't come around. <laughs> Yeah, like, we're in the middle of nowhere, yeah. and I literally saw a man walking by the window. Yeah. Diction. Diction? Is that what it says? Or is that your last name? Diction. Yeah, I'm gonna stand on her bed. She says... It says diction. diction. I'm standing on your bed, Brenda. Yo. There was a noise just out there just saying, but let's just keep it going, keep it going. Is it okay if I stand on her bed? Hey, that was weird. I think it's just the movement of the bed that's making me nauseous. George. George. George! Is that what it said? George? We got a George! We George. got his name! George. Oh it, my god! Is George the one who did this to you? Make a noise, a bang, tap on something. Repeat after me if that is correct. Is George the one who did this? What's that noise? Yeah, I hear it. That's like someone moving in the house. No, it's not like someone dragging something in the house. Yeah. 
residual energy. I heard like a heartbeat too for a split second in my ear. It could be the residual energy of even dragging the body out. <gasps> the music box is going on. Shh, 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 shh. Something walked past it for a split second. Oh, something is in there. In the living room. And we heard something being dragged. Bro, whose light is that? What? Whose light is that? Turn yours off. Oh, it's mine. Oh, thank God. I thought. I left the light in there. Okay. Uh, should we go in? Oven. Oven, okay. Should we go in here? It's so much colder out here, isn't it? Yeah. You can really feel the temperature change. Keep the light on in here, bro. I love the light. Oh, yeah. Something tripped that sound box. Yeah. We all heard it. Let's stay in this half of the room so we don't trigger it ourselves. But it was but a brief second. Can you look. Something triggered it. Something triggered it. But for a brief second. Yeah, just whizzed right past it. This is real, guys. None of this is scripted. None of this is acted. This is 100% real. And, and and this is just mind-boggling. That's true. Can't fucking deny it. No. This is 100% happening. Brenda, if that was you, could you please step in front of this music box again? I turned it off. Oh, you turned it off? Yeah, just because... Um Going off like crazy. Yeah, yeah. Set it back up. If, if we can just catch her movements, then we know what room she's in each time. Listen, clearly, every time somebody goes into her room, we start to get Bitch. more paranormal activity. Flowers. Flowers. Oh! No, 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 no. no. It's, it's calibrating. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Now. If it Dude, goes that up. took forever to calibrate. Yeah, I was going to say, that took a long time. It did yeah. take a long and my time. My EMF was going crazy when that yeah. was happening. Flower, guys. Oh! oh. Now that's now. not. Oh. Bro! Shh. It's going off. She's in the hallway. Do Brenda, it do it again, please. Oh. Wow, fuck. Bro, she is in there. She's in there. Oh, my God. Brenda, thank you so much. Can you keep affecting that device? It lets us know you're here with us. Can you walk in front of it again, please? Hey, mate. Yeah, yeah, she's here. Thank you. Can you answer questions with this device, Brenda? That's a yes. Guys, guys, really? Really? No! It just said no. It said no! Oh Your thing just said no when I asked. Brenda, please, can you try? Could you set off the music box if you know who killed you? Wait. Liberty. 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 Well, she didn't get any justice. Well. Was George the one that killed you? Hold on a minute. Something just moved. Yeah, I don't know. George, are you here? What the hell was that? What was that? Dude, there's noises happening. Just when I said, George, are you here? Br Brenda? Are you stuck here forever? Yeah, she is. Guys, there's literally an entity standing right in front of this In device. the hallway. Just let's show. Let's no just there. show there's no one there yet. You want to show you No one is there. No one here. This is not set off by light or anything. No. Nope. This, is, this is ultrasonic. It has to be physical. It's an ultrasonic detector. So she, that, that means she is in the bedroom now. Yeah. Lights and shadows cannot set that off. God dang it. Brenda, can, can sorry. Can you show your? Can you show yourself? Can you actually appear for us? Labor. 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 George the laborer killed her, maybe? Maybe, yeah. Possibly. Did you just touch the door? No. Yeah. It just it, it just bumped into me. Hold on. What do you mean? It's moving. I didn't do that. Literally, I was just sat there and the door hit me. Oh, oh, oh. Holiday. Holiday. The door is closing, guys. What did it say? It's slowly... Don't touch it, don't touch it. I'm not touching it. I'm moving the brick to see how far it can actually go. Hey, Brenda, close that door right now. Slam it. Oh, my God. Close it all the way. Now, if you can close it again, now it stops. Or open it. Is it tap? What? What's making that? I don't know. Stand by. Let's listen Stand by. Let's Something's listen going on here. Something's happening. Stay quiet. Brenda, close or open this door. Do it for me. You know that feeling when you think somebody's just going to jump out at you? 
Dave. Dave. It's just given names now. George, Dave, Felipe. Maybe it's more than one person that killed her. Yeah, we just seen. We don't know. It could be a group. Brenda, I know we're cornered in this room right now, and we will do our best not to scream, but if you can actually appear on camera right now, I've only ever seen a ghost with my own eyes once. If you could be the second I've ever seen, the second spirit person I've ever seen in my life, it would be a, an honor for it to be you. Could you please show yourself to us now? I'll turn the light off, even. Let's call lights off, please. All, well, I just saw an orb on the camera. Oh, you have the night vision. Yep. Oh, just went past. Oh, that is setting up properly. Brenda, did you have two people that murdered you? Was it two or one? This is abnormal, man. But it, I never had a single voice. 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 Can we hear your voice? If we can't show yourself, can you let us hear you? I'm actually genuinely a bit shook up. Yeah, <laughs> Not yeah. gonna lie. Yeah, this is the craziest one I've ever been on. We should, we should do more in the bedroom now. Yeah. yeah. Let's go to the bedroom. She's in the bedroom using the other device and setting this off. It's like she's walking back and forth between the device and... and, the device and device yeah, yeah, yeah. There's literally nothing here to cause this. Thing. No, I know. Look at that. It's just going off. There's no dust particles. There's no bugs. Dust particles won't do it. It has to be something big and physical. As you can see, I'm setting this thing off right now. Turn it off. In the bedroom. Yeah. Let's shoot off a, a Polaroid in here. Oh, yeah. whoa, 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 whoa. Look, see, it's, it's oh. doing it. It's going off. It's going K off. K2's going off. In the and the K2's maxing out. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? K2's maxing out. That's going that, off. Is that why it's setting it off at all? That's not the light. No, because it was off a second. No. See, it's not the light. I'm going to turn my light off for a sec. That is max. It's completely max. What the hell? Brenda is making the K2 go off. Brenda, are you doing this? Yes. That was confirmation. <laughs> yeah. Sure, everyone. There's nothing near it. Nothing near it. The whole house is just spiked with EMF. What the hell? Everyone step back. What the hell is going on? fucking weird. Wait, let me, let me check on Mike. Where's Whoa. that? And that's still going off, bro. You got that Polaroid camera. I think it's time. Why is it mine going off? That's a good question. Then let's check mine as well. Uh, I haven't yeah. changed the battery in mine in a while. Maybe oh, that's mine's in the other room. That's odd. Oh, look oh, at yeah, mine. Yeah, now yours is going oh, off. What the hell is going on? Okay, so it's clear the house is filled with EMF right now, which they're, is what. They're both going crazy. We believe this is what spirits may have. Bro, you gotta take a photo in the hallway. Right, you ready? Get that Polaroid camera out and let's see if we can capture her so on camera. Will you hold this thing on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Polaroid camera. He's only got two films. We're going to take two shots it. and see what happens. If we get something, then we're going to continue this investigation throughout the night even longer. If not, we're going to call it a night. We've got... <sighs> What's wrong? I thought I heard somebody walking over your machine. No? no. Okay, if we don't catch anything, we're going to call it a night and you know what? We've got names. Right, the way we're going to do it is. It's primed and ready to go. Yeah. What we'll do is we'll try and uh, ask some questions and try and get that to go off. And the moment it goes off, I'll snap a picture. Perfect. Now it's time, bro. Now is the time. You want light or no light? Yeah. I just want, let me get some light in here. Yeah, we're, he's going to need light for a Polaroid okay. picture. Right, yeah. Sure. Do you want to put the floodlight out there? Yeah, yeah. Right. Um, Mo, no, your hand's free. Can you grab that light under the table? Yeah. Hand it to Dan so he can set it up there. And we're going to try and snap this Dude. photo as soon as that thing goes off. There's too much going on. I know, this I know, I know. Is this... Uh, yeah. Right, um, Brenda, or if anyone else is here, I have a Polaroid camera here. All you need to do, set this off, and I know where to take a picture. As soon as this goes off, I will snap off a picture. So if you can, please just come and step in front of here. Show yourself on the camera. Um, you know, it's it's gonna it's gonna really please us. It truly is. And then we'll leave you alone. Yeah, if you want to yeah. be left alone, we'll we'll just leave you alone. I promise you. Or do you not want to be left alone? Yeah. She Why? doesn't. She doesn't want to be left alone. Why'd you get scared like that? Because it scared me. Just caught him off guard. Oh shit. I thought because, she answered, because it answered, she doesn't want to be left alone. Okay. But bro, you, you snapped it right in the perfect time. Yeah, I did. How long oh, does wait. that take? 10 minutes. 
Okay. Okay. Let's do another yeah. one as soon as another noise. Yeah, try nice. try one more. Just set that one down for a okay, minute. Okay, thank you so much, whoever that was. If that was you, Brent. I wasn't ready. It's okay, it's okay. If you, I can take another one for you. Um, we can stay a bit longer if you want. If you want to stay a bit longer, just let us know by setting that off. And I can take another picture. It would mean a lot. If you can, just, just step forward a little bit closer. Brenda, is it that you actually want us to leave? Light up if you want us. Oh, she wants. One. She wants us to go. We got it. We got it backwards. Good one. You got it. Okay. Let's, yeah, she really wants us to go. Oh, that was tense. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell, man. Okay. Okay. I might have a couple more less than this. I don't know. Okay. There might be one. There might be none. I say, if you do have, try to do some in the bedroom. Just go to the bedroom. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. We're gonna leave those and let them develop. Oh my god. Right. I don't have a light, so someone's gonna have to guide me into the bedroom. Okay, here, let me go ahead. Uh, yeah, go for it. Go for it. Uh, put this facing that way. Yeah. Turn it off. And Henri Calibre. Okay. Alright, Brenda. Come back into your room. It's going off. No, it's calibrated. I thought it already no. calibrated. But no, we didn't turn it off. Did you? Yeah, I turned it off because I pointed it in a different direction, so you gotta recalibrate it. So turn it off, back okay. on, it's calibrated, if it goes off again, it's okay. on there. Well, if you're taking a picture of the bed, and we got to stand back here. Just to show you guys that when things are not right, like we're calibrating something, we're actually telling you. So we're debunking the things that are not real. Yes, yeah, so we correct. need to make sure you guys know when, when things are calibrated and stuff, you know, because I, I want to I wanna kind of eliminate any kind of possible contamination. Exactly. If it's real, you know. Exactly. Um, what we'll do, I'm going to try a different thing. Hopefully I've got another film in this. But more, they seem to be quite triggered by you. So what I'm thinking... Lay on more, the bed, bro. You can even just stand by the door, hold your hand out, and we'll try and get Brenda to stand next to you and hold your hand, and we'll get a picture. Because if we can get a picture of some, some, something stood next to you, or even orbs next to your hand... Okay. I'll do it, bro. That's brilliant. I'll do it. I'm going to knock my camera over here. Yeah, you can okay. it, though. Okay. Goes. There you go, that's perfect. Alright, what do you want me to do? Okay, Brenda, if you can come and stand next to our friend Mo, we're going to take a picture. If you can stand next to Mo, you can hold his hand, and I promise you we will leave if you want us to. Right, we, we, we will not waste any more of your time. So. <gasps> oh! Oh, there's a guy outside the window. Oh my god. What? Oh the fucking hell yeah. Where? It's, it's just walked up the road. Oh. oh okay. It's okay, it's okay. I thought, I thought it was a ghost. It was a person that just walked by the house. Why the hell is there somebody walking by the house? I don't know, but we are mate, getting pretty sus now with all the lights. Let's get this Polaroid and probably yeah, get out of here. Right. And we can even check we can check the photos in the car. I thought it was a freaking ghost. It's okay. Right, okay, Brenda or anyone else, any other spirits uh, who may do well on this property, now is your chance to show yourselves. If you can stand next to Mo while I take this photo, it'd be brilliant. Are you ready? That's the last one. Do you guys think maybe we should let them, we'll get our shit go? Because it is getting a bit sus. We can check them in the car. Yeah. yeah see what turned out. Of here. Um, there was somebody right outside the window looking at us. So they might yeah. call the cops on us or not because we're not supposed to be here. Let's go and we'll check out these. Oh. That was the last Fancy. one. Okay. Last okay. one. Perfect. We'll check out the polaroids in the car later on. Let's yeah. Go. Let's let's I get her. I was gonna see if I could take another one, like spontaneously. In case, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so we in case we caught something. But absolutely, last one. We got three. Okay, cool. Here's your oh, here's your camera back. Thank you. Let's make moves. And, like look at them all together. For the record, we're still right outside the house. Oh yeah. Yeah, we haven't left the house. But it's just right there. Oh, yeah. We're still right outside. Okay, so you have them ready. Oh, okay. Yeah. They, they look creepy already. Let me just put this out real quick. In order of them being taken. Do we see anything? Nothing out of the ordinary. No, there's a weird anomaly there. Oh yeah. 
But that's not. It's not on that one, but it's on that one. You see? This little thing here. Yeah, that anomaly there. But this one is clear. That's. Oh, it's it's right beside me on the bed. Oh, there is something there. Oh, you caught an orb. Right there. It was manifesting. Right there. Oh, if only we had another felt another one in the I know. Oh my god. It's right there. There's an orb right beside me on the bed. I'm not gonna lie, Mo, that should be your new Instagram profile. <laughs> <laughs> it looks proper sick actually. Yeah, that is pretty cool, but that's creepy, dude. So you caught a weird anomaly there and a weird anomaly right at the bottom of that one. Right there. Right guys, um, it's one of those investigations. <laughs> it really takes it out of you. So a lot has happened. Mo, you were brilliant. Honestly, I, I, I you're a good ghost hunter. You really are. I, I've known this. Uh, truth be told, just a small story for my viewers. Back when I was starting my channel a long time ago, right? This was ages ago. I used to watch Omar and Mo and all of them, right? James the fam. And I would see them. I'd always sit there and go, one day, one day I'm going to be a full-time paranormal YouTuber like these guys. And like, now I'm filming with the guy. Hey. Fucking filming with the dude. That's awesome. <laughs> Thank and you. Dan. Dan's just down. He's all right. <laughs> I'm not too bad. He's good He's good enough that we were able to fall out and become friends again. That's, <laughs> that, that's how good we are together as well. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed that video, click this link right here. It's an absolute banger of a video. Don't even think about it. Just click it. And we'll end it as we always do. Do you believe yet?